Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video from Bird1. Today I'm going to show you a really short video about what I've made for you guys and it's pretty easy to answer all your questions because I have many questions about benchmarks of different types of GPUs and I was like, okay, let's just add a page on our website and here we go. So what did I add? I added two links at the beginning of this page. It's called GPU hash rates, by the way. And the only two I could find was for Zcash benchmarks and Monero benchmarks. So if you want to see that, just click on uh, the link and you'll be redirected to see all the results of people, their mining hash rates and power usage. So this is really useful to find your best settings, of course. And it's a really big list, so it's pretty easy to find your things. But of course, uh, you could also go to Monero. But I added a few average hash rates for cards. So you can know if you're gonna buy an RX 474GB for example, you will mine 24.5 mega hashes per second if you use this core and memory speed at a power of 85 watts. So if you BIOS mod it, it will change to 28.5 for example. And also I added a average of all cards because um, Monero and Zcash are really fluctuating between card brands like some like the G1 gaming has higher clock speeds than any other card and that will increase it to 750 but if you just have a sapphire it may be only 700 hashes per second so that's why I added plus minus because I'm not really sure what the maximum hash rate is. so we're just gonna go and take an average so you can see the difference between cards so I have it for all the cards like RX 480s, RX 480s, 8GB and even the RX 570s with some confirmed clock speeds and hash rates so you know that it's possible to get this hash rate with these cards. So first of all I want to tell you something about the RX 570 and RX 580. They seem to be using a lot more power than they have to do to get a certain hash rate. So even when we BIOS mod these cards, we can only get 28 mega hashes per second out of an RX 570. So I'm not really sure if this card is worth it yet until someone really finds some good mining speeds on this card. But for now, I also filled in all the Monero and Zcash hash speeds that I've found so far. So also I added the GTX 1060 and GTX 1070, 1080 and 1080 Ti. The only thing I could find of the 1080 Ti was the 710 solutions per second for Zcash but I'm not really sure it's only 85 watts because I cannot find that result so I will still change that if I find some solutions. So I want to benchmark all the cards on 85 watts but I'm not really sure if this is really possible in the future so I will change this along the way when I'm updating the website. So hopefully you guys like this and if you want to post your own hash rate speeds just tweet it or whatsoever, put it on Facebook. Just call it add hash, hash clocks and I will try to fill it in into the website and get a better average result. So hope you all enjoyed the video and see you guys in the next one.